Hi guys, welcome to SA Technical. If you are facing boot configuration issues on a UEFI based Windows 11 system, this guide will help you to resolve the issue step by step. Don't worry, this process is very straightforward if followed carefully. So let's get started. To fix the issue, you will need a Windows installation media. This can be a bootable USB drive or a CD DVD with Windows 11 setup file. If you don't have one, check out our tutorial on creating a Windows installation media. Once you are ready, follow the steps. Insert your Windows installation media into the computer's USB port and restart your computer and be ready to enter the boot menu by pressing the designated key. It varies by manufacturer, often F2, F12 or Escape. Select the media you have inserted to boot from that. Now choose your language preference and click next. At the install now screen, select repair your computer. Now navigate to troubleshoot, then advanced option, and then command prompt. In command prompt, type bcd edit and press enter. This displays the current bcd setup, including paths, OS identifier, and drive information. Now launch disk part. Type disk part and hit enter. Now we will need to identify our boot disk. Type list disk and press enter to select the boot disk where Windows is installed. For example, if the boot disk is disk 1, type cell disk 1 and hit enter. To see list of all volumes, type list fall and hit enter. Now look for the volume formatted as FAT32. This is your EFI partition. Ensure this is not a USB drive. Now select the EFI volume. If it's volume 4, type cell vol 4 and hit enter. Now we will need to assign a unique drive letter. Type assign letter equals to your drive letter and hit enter. To confirm, type list fall and press enter. Ensure E5 partition is assigned to the correct drive letter. Now exit from the disk part. Type exit and hit enter. Type cd space for slash d space your assigned drive letter colon backward slash EFI backward slash Microsoft backward slash boot backward slash and press enter to check the boot files under this path. If you want, you can separately check each directories by following screen instructions. As you can see, here is the secure boot executable file and also you will see your BCD files under this path. To recreate the BCD using BCD boot command, switch to your OS drive which is commonly C. But what if the OS drive later differs? In rare cases, the OS drive might not be C. In that case, you will need to use dark command on other drive letters to find the Windows directory. Type C colon and hit enter. Confirm it contains the Windows directory by typing dar and hit enter. No, not here. Use the dar command on other drive letters to find the correct Windows directory. Alright, as you can see, here it is. Next, you will need to format the EFI partition. Why format EFI partition? Formatting EFI partition removes corrupt or outdated boot files. Recreating the BCD ensures a clean boot configuration. Type format space your assigned drive letter colon space for slash fs colon fat32 and press enter and press Y to confirm. Note, if prompted to set a volume level, press enter to leave it as default. 
You can verify by typing your assign drive letter colon and press enter and type dir and press enter to confirm. Well, our EFI volume is completely empty without volume level as you can see. Now type your OS drive letter colon and press enter and verify by typing dir. Now run the following command to recreate the BCD. Type bcd boot space your os drive letter colon backward slash windows space for slash s space your assigned drive letter colon space for slash f space all and hit enter. A success message will confirm that the boot files were created successfully. Alright. Here's the final steps. Type exit and hit enter to exit from the command prompt. Now turn off your PC and remove the Windows installation media and check if the boot issue is resolved. Alright, as you can see we have successfully fixed the missing boot configuration in Windows 11 EVFI. So I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.